We're, go, we're going to England. Bristol, to be exact. Mm. To visit our friends Yogscast. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. For a special brand-integrated adventure. It's featuring dinosaurs. Like that one that I love. Oh, yeah. Okay, it's only going to take one second. Oh, it's Oh, I'm alive, and I'm here to tell you that MK Ultra was a real project the government used to mind control people and kill other people. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. That did work. Bye. You're welcome. When Frontier Development approached us about doing a Game Grumps and Yogg's Cast collaboration to help promote their new game, Jurassic World Evolution, we thought, hang on a second, this could be an amazing opportunity to pay homage or just wholeheartedly rip off one of our favourite British TV cooking shows. Now, obviously, for legal reasons, we're going to have to change the name and also try and make it sound a bit more dinosaur-y. So welcome to the Jurassic Make-Off. I did Make-Off, yeah, I did Make-Off? Did I say Make? Yeah, good, good. I keep saying the other one. That's Aaron, I'm Dan. We do a show called Game Grumps. Hi, I'm Lewis from the Yogscast. I play games and eat things out of the microwave. Hi, I'm Sips from the Yogscast. Also, I eat things from the microwave. Yeah, we were on a flight for 12 hours. We drove for two hours. Yeah. And then I slept for half an hour. And now we're here in England. Across the next four episodes, we're gonna see a series of challenges that are gonna test their creativity, their cooking ability, and their dinosaur knowledge. In other words, they're fucked. We've got two experts on hand to help us. From Sorted Food, we've got their professional chef, Ben Everill. And from the Bristol Dinosaur Project, we've got Rhys Charles, both experts outstanding in their field. A bit like me, really. Outstanding in a f field. You know, I've always wanted to be those guys in Jurassic Park, making the embryos, taking the, the little bugs out the of the amber, yeah. and putting the, making it into a delicious omelette. Yeah. That's gonna be our signature dish today. Mosquitoes in embryos. I make a mean frozen dinner. <laughs> nice. I like Cheerios. I pour Cheerios into a bowl. Are we too far from the camera right now? No, oh, this, is, this is my vision. Don't ruin this for me. Okay, Punish okay, me. chill out. Punish me. <laughs> All right, relax. Exciting times, guys. Challenge number one. Now, obviously, dinosaurs were cool, we all know that. But some of the coolest dinosaurs were called sauropods. Am I saying that right? Sauropods? Sauropods are long-necked dinosaurs, and the longest neck on a dinosaur belonged to a Mementiosaurus, whose neck was, in theory, 18 metres long in length-ish. That's nine times the length of a giraffe's neck. That's a long neck. So what we're asking you guys to do today is to create a cake in the shape of a sauropod. We want just the neck up. We want a vertical freestanding cake that is gonna be judged on how tall it is and how much like a dinosaur it looks like. And then I guess, tasty? Well, we would hope so. So you're gonna have one hour and 30 minutes in which to do this challenge. And uh, uh, Game Grumps, if you uh, maybe wanna put your shirts back on as well. Us? How are we gonna make an 80 meter cake? Oh, uh -huh. oh, oh, oh shit. I know what the people want. What do they want, Sips? They want some of this. Do you know you can't break an egg, like, <laughs> yeah, just I by can. squeezing? Really? No, no, by squeezing it. By squeezing. Oh, oh, oh. Like if you like, oh shit. <laughs> what does a dinosaur look like, Sips? Right? Like they that. don't all have spikes though. That... I'm just, I'm just kidding. Gonna... <laughs> 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 we'll deal with it later. This. Here's some macarons. Spells in my pen. Whoa. And here is. Perfect. It's taken shape. Hey, we're done. <laughs> it's a wrap. <laughs> Is there any sorts of textures or colors a Mementiosaurus or a sauropod might have had? These aren't the dinosaurs with feathers. These are big, these are scaly dinosaurs, the classic reptilian kind of look. Are there gonna be any kind of common mistakes they might make? All we're looking for is a classic sponge done well, and if it's light enough, they should be able to build layers and layers and layers, and it won't squash. The great thing about a perfect Victoria sponge is it's a simple ratio for basic ingredients. There's not many places you can go wrong. How many ounces are in a liter? It's probably one liter. How much does a teaspoon weigh? Right? Is that in ounces? More! It's a cake, it needs to be sweet. That's perfect. That, is, that looks like more, all right. Plus a little extra for dusting the finished cake. 
You have to be very precise when you're measuring. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. That's perfect. That's a lot of sugar. Are you sure that's right? We're going to be using that later for the second cake. Yeah, we don't like to waste food. We're if not you... food wasters. Okay. So one tablespoon. Are you sure about eight eggs? Eight ounces of butter at room temperature. Where the fuck is the butter? They actually just finding the butter for us. Are you kidding me? What, what kind, kind of, of operation is this? Operation? Hey, look at theirs. It's all goopy already. Yeah, yeah, we got cake yeah. batter. Jealous? What I do you am, think? Actually, that's really goopy. Listen to this sound. And a little sprinkle of magic. Da 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 da. The more you know. Then you Is press the button. Oh shit. <laughs> there we go, Lewis. Look at this. Shit, they're already using their mixer. There we go. It's just one tin. Oh, that's looking pretty good. Did you wash your hands? You went to the bathroom like right before we started cooking. Yeah, well, pee is the sterilizer. Is that right, Brent? Can you look that up? Yeah, Brent says yes. It's so much easier. I don't even need to use any hands. Where's yep. the second tin? Right here. Oh, it's like a layered cake. Yeah. That's perfect. Hey, kids, we, I got a little cake powder left. Lick the spoon, and then you're like, ah, Aaron, <laughs> there's raw eggs. <laughs> okay, so, uh. <laughs> oh, it was delicious. <laughs> Okay, that's ready, Lewis. Just crack a little egg right on top. Boom. For taste. This cost me eight quid. Oh, the butter's here. Oh, wow. Yes. There you go. So you part are of the challenge challenging me. part of a challenge. What, are you mad? How is this gonna work? No, no. This, is taking, this is taking way too long. Just no, throw them. No, 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 no. When it cooks, it's gonna melt out. So then we just pick them out of the, the cake. You're actually right. Seven grams, yeah. I need a kilo of butter. That means I need approximately a hundred. And now, we bake. Whoops. Sips has already oh, wow. created yeah. okay. some terrific Is this the face? masterpiece. Is, bonus, Is yeah. this a dinosaur? Right, well, we'll leave you to carry on. You've got about an hour left. Well, if you get some motherfucking butter, oh, okay. we'll actually be able to do it. Okay, well, you've got some butter. <laughs> and let's see how the other guys are getting on. So, Send it. on the tables. Come I on. feel like you guys are ahead of the game because your cake's in the oven. Hell yeah, we're ahead of the game. No, okay. not the whole okay. egg, Aaron. What are you, insane? What, half the egg? Yeah, Okay, half the egg. <laughs> So you guys gonna eat this with us? Yeah, of what? course. Oh yeah, I kind of never like cakes because they're like not sweet enough for me. So we decided to, to add in a little more sweetness by throwing in some like some more sugar and some more icing. And is that enough mix for 80 meters? Don't look, Ben. It's gonna to loosen it up. It polishes the icing. There. Mash it there. That, that should be good. Pour Let that the flavor just fall right into in. it. Oh, what are you doing? Melting butter. <gasps> the boss is here. Okay, oh, that's real take butter. that off, take that off. But a butter pan. pan in here. He wants to use four butters. <laughs> Just soften it a little bit. Okay, this looks fucking perfect, Sips. Great job. <laughs> Great fucking job. I, I think, think we, we need, need to, a bigger bowl. We need bowl. slightly less butter from this one, so, ooh. Oh, Lewis. Oh, I cut myself. That's Lewis bad. cut his fingers. First aid, we need first aid. That's it, that's first blood, Lewis Sips. is dying. First blood. Oh, blimey, we do, okay. I'm bleeding on here now. I have to keep stirring. <laughs> Chocolate beans? Yes, please. I think we're done. I think our cake is probably finished. Yeah, I feel like it's been uh, at least 10 minutes. Look wow. at that. Wow. That's looking like a meringue right, right now. Right, right? I'm gonna be honest, it smells almost nothing like a cake. But, but it's gonna taste like It's gonna taste like heaven. heaven. <laughs> All right, well, oh, it's a little liquidy. Now that is something special. And gently ladle the frosting. There we go. You know it's good because it's spilling out the sides with flavor. Jurassic. <laughs> Get your hero shot right now, folks. Before it gets gobbled up. <laughs> Oh, Sips, I just want to make a cake. I've always wanted to do this. I'm thinking that if we made like some scaffolding out of fettuccine. Cut me two slices, please. We'll, we'll, get, we'll put it we'll on use that. We'll use that. That's how you serve it at a party. You put it on a napkin. Yeah. A little fun fact. Now let's grab a nice heap in peace. Perfect. I'm going to make a slice for myself. Oh. Do we have a fork? Oh, um, here, use scissors. Bottoms up. Wait, wait, Aaron. 
What? <laughs> you forgot the rainbow sprinkles. Oh, yeah. All right. All right. Here we go. Wait, wait, wait. Rainbow sprinkles. Couple more bigger rainbow sprinkles. Perfect. <clears throat> oh, wait, 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 wait. Jimmy style rainbow sprinkles. Yep. Real New England classic. All wait, right. Wait, wait, wait. Yellow. All right. Here and we go. in that time, they brought us forks. Bottoms up. Aaron just had a nice, delicious bite, and he's going to take a little walk. He's going <laughs> to... It's fine. How was it, Aaron? It was perfect. <laughs> We're going to make some last... last minute modifications, and uh, we'll, we'll see you in a... Yeah, just one, just one cake, like a like a fully made cake. What, whatever you got. Yeah, it's well, I don't care. I don't. Care. It's whatever you have. Oh, oh, oh boy! Shit! They're looking fantastic. One. That one has sagged massively in the this, middle when you put it down. Oh my god! Look at this one. Oh, oh shit! Not this one though. Woohoo! That's looking all right. It looks perfect. Oh shit, yes. Cool, thank you, thank, thank you so you. much. Thank you, this is awesome, thank you. Thank you. Does that say happy birthday, Ashley? Yeah, well, I mean, it's all they had, so. Okay, it's actually Ashley Soros. Whoops, Let's squeeze out a little. That's perfect. <laughs> it's a little bit goopy in the middle. Well, we can cut around that though, we can use these bits. That's what all the pro chefs do. <laughs> There's an eye, and there's another eye. That's perfect. I mean, it looks like it. It's perfect. It, it looks perfect. just like a Megalosaurus. Whoa! Oh yeah, good idea, Lewis. Marshmallows. That's too hot, you have it's to wait. It's not too hot. You've got to want to cut it up now, because otherwise. Can, no, it's way too hot. It has to settle. It's not too hot, it's just right. It has to settle for a minute. It's just right. Hold on, hold on, let me, let me take this. Shit, no. Mm. Wait, if we just get, shit. You can't just shit. grab no, cake can... like that. I know what I'm doing. We don't want the middle bit, do we? Just cut around it. Yeah, just another one. Okay. I know that was, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Fast, please. Look at oh, that, okay, though. yeah. Look at that, actually. That's perfect. I feel I like wanna... we could just win with just that bit, you know? That's a really good bit. Yes, thank, thank you, you, you so you much. Are You're saver. awesome. You are the best. <laughs> and done. Wow. Could you get a more beautiful cake than that? Okay, teams, we got five minutes to finish your cakes. Okay, so it's gonna have hang some on, sort of scaffolding on. in it. This looks perfect. Yes. It can be technically taller if it has a spire. Uh, okay, give, give me the green color. Oh, that's very green. Yeah, yeah perfect. Oh, look at that! Oh, oh it's too shit, heavy. Shit, it's heavy, yeah. Look at that. Look at that, it's that. We need to really make it look like a dinosaur. Okay. Eyes, give it eyes. How's that look? It's alive! Oh, if it's just sort of use it slowly as like, falling over. Use it as like a cement on the side. Look, now it's like a bird. It can see in both directions. Yeah, like a chameleon. Take a picture quick before it falls over. Oh, America, the freedom source. <laughs> okay, guys, that's it. Time up, tools down. I think we're done. That's a masterpiece. Done. If it stands yeah, for three it, seconds, then that means it's done. It's done. We multiplied all of the ingredients because of the volume. Four times. Four times. <laughs> Four times. <laughs> and um, America, America, God shed his grace on thee or, or her. And crown thy good with brotherhood from sea to shining sea. sea. I lost the sea. note because you tried to harmonize. Sea, sea, sea. sea. We almost sea. got it. Sea. There it is. Anyway, what's the next question? Congratulations on completing the first challenge. We now need to judge your efforts. Yogscast, if you'd like to bring your cake. Can we present 
the Shittosaurus is an addition, a little baby Shittosaurus. So oh, wow, back yeah. in the early Jurassic really cool. period, there was a rare form of, of dinosaur. We've heard rumors of its deliciousness and healthiness for you to enjoy. I was brought along here to judge the proper scientific accuracy, the nitty gritty and... Right. I can't say I've seen a dinosaur that looks like this before. You did bake a sponge. You have made a version of a chocolate marshmallow frosting and you've iced it. Thank it's you. all there <laughs> in <laughs> some so form or other. <laughs> think, this is the bit I'm scared I think, of. I think I'm holding a fork, oh, which no. suggests I have to taste it. Oh, I don't. Would you recommend a specific area of the dinosaur that you think I is strongest? I stay away from the butt. Go oh, on. look at that consistency. Look, it's very springy. Ooh. Ooh. Still slightly warm. That's the salmonella. Buttery, golden. Do you know what? That bit of the sponge is not bad. You guys oh are going to be in the hospital tonight. I would not eat that. Those parts that you presented, that's almost cake. That's fantastic. Well, <laughs> guys, if you'd like no. to uh, take that back to your cooking station. Oh, do we have to? Almost cake. Game Grumps, if you'd like to bring your creation up to the table. Ooh. This is the Democrosaurus. Mm. Uh, it eats freedom. Mm. And well, and then it and then parts out more freedom. Mm -hmm. It it creates a byproduct of like a perpetual free yeah, freedom. Yeah. No, it only yeah. creates more. Right. Yeah. I mean, it's it is beautiful. Thank um, you. We definitely made it. So, yeah. Okay. I have spent many years studying dinosaurs. I can honestly say I've never seen one look quite like this before. Well, well, here's the thing. This dinosaur originally was discovered by a paleontologist, Elizabeth. Maybe you've heard of her. Queen Elizabeth? I don't see, I think I see enough Elizabeth to change my mind there. Uh, well, that's fine. I mean, um, if you don't like the cake, you know, it's, it's not going to hurt us. Right. Oh, yeah, yeah. It could hurt others. Great cake, guys. Thank you. Really, Thank, really you. Thank you. Thank you. I think it's a miracle that that arrived after some of the methods we saw earlier, but it looks beautiful. That's what happens. <laughs> oh, wow. When did you guys make the jam? Oh, uh, yesterday. Yeah. It, it takes like a day to make. Yeah, we flew over with it. Uh, buttercream in that as well. Very rich. Mm. Thank very you. Very rich. Yeah. You're going to be very rich. That's a great cake. That's... I was going for a second. That yeah. is a great cake. Thank, yeah. Thank it you. It is, isn't it? Thank you. It does appear like this is the taller of the two structures. Wow, how about that? Mm -hmm. Taller than... So that that's is. definitely that's factoring in. How edible is the neck? Do you want to try? <laughs> I assure you. Oh, yeah, we, we've already had some, guys. You, you help yourselves sure. to the oh, neck. Yeah, uh, yeah, of course. But yeah, that makes sense. Mm. Mm -hmm. So good. Oh, yeah. Well, if you ate it all, then I can't you even. You have the head is. Yeah, well, I'm saving it. Oh, okay. And the, uh, the eyes are edible. Oh, oh, oh. Mm -hmm. Bottoms up. <laughs> so good. So mm. good. Mm. Well, that's <laughs> something. Right, so like wow, fantastic. Guys, we've got a lot of deliberation there. If you'd like to take that back to your sure. to your uh, yeah, workstation. Of sure, mm -hmm. and, of course. Um, wow. Yeah. And this is... Uh, yeah, yeah we'll, we'll just leave the crumbs. Yeah, we'll let okay. somebody cool. clean that up okay. after us. Okay, well, thank you, guys. I think we're going to go away and deliberate over those two uh, spectacular dinosaur-themed cakes, and uh, we'll come back with our results on who won that challenge. Well, clearly our cake is better. Mm-hmm. It was almost as if it was finally crafted by talented baketicians. Yeah, like us. We definitely crafted it. Do you think it falls within the rules of the challenge itself? Yeah, it's Yeah, it looks like a fucking dinosaur. Yeah. Back off, Tom. Thank you very much, teams. It has not been an easy decision, but when judging these cakes based on the contributions of style, flavor, appearance, dino authenticity, and obviously height, I'm afraid there can only be one winner. It's a very close call, but the winner is the Game Grumps. Fantastic. Both were absolutely delicious. Yo, Scott, I feel like 10 more minutes in the oven and that wobbly bit in the middle, you could have stacked that too and got the height. Otherwise, great effort, so close. As I said, it doesn't look like any dinosaur I've seen before, but that's the joy of paleontology. There's always more dinosaurs to discover. You never know what you might find. They this might guy, look this like This guy that. gets it. That's a good outlook. That's a good outlook. This Fantastic. is probably gonna be the next dinosaur discovered. So there we go, so thank you very much. Uh, if you would like to clear your workstations, we're gonna have another challenge up next where we're gonna be testing some other skills of yours. Do it, do it, do it. No, he's no, too cute. No, don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. Oh, good, he's a good dog. 
So there we have it. Challenge number one is done, but the competition is just heating up. Shit! So the next episode is going to air on Yogg's Cast channel at <laughs> 6 p.m. British Standard Time on Friday, August 3rd.